if your project looks like this, microservices in the backend, but the frontend is a monolith, then you might be able to develop features independently, but you won't be able to deploy those features fully independently. To achieve this, you need to adapt to micro frontends. Here's a simple and pragmatic approach to micro frontends, which I have been using successfully for the past five years. To demo the approach, I have prepared a simple web application, which will serve as the host for the individual features. The features A and B are realized as individual web applications as well. To keep the demo simple, we will completely ignore any backend. Instead, we simply simulate data loading from the backend using a timer. When we now run these three web applications, we can see that each application is fully self-contained. When I considered how these features could be integrated into the hosting application, I identified two key principles. First, features should be integrated only through a URL and should not expose any JavaScript API. Second, each feature should be able to use a different technology stack. To achieve these principles, we will use an iframe-based approach. Therefore, let's create a dedicated component to encapsulate the implementation details. We need to apply these attributes to the iframe so that the integrated application is fully functional and that the user does not realize the existence of the iframe. Let's also add a random ID to the URL to prevent the browser from caching. In the hosting application, we will import the fragment container and integrate it into the HTML template. To keep the tutorial simple, we will hardcode the URLs to the features. In production, we would retrieve these URLs from the backend, which would probably read those from some configuration. At this point, no change in the features is required. If we now reload the hosting application in the browser, we can see that both features are integrated and appear to the user as if they would be part of the application itself. But we can also identify one remaining issue. The content of the integrated feature UIs is not fully visible. To fix this problem, we need to resize the iframe when the data of each feature is loaded and visualized in its UI. The solution requires two steps. First, we add a resize observer to the main view of each feature. This observer observes size changes of the DOM element it is attached to and sends a message to the parent window for each change. When integrated in our hosting application, this will be the window of the hosting application. Then we will register an event handler for those messages in the fragment container. If a message is received from the origin for which the fragment container is configured, it updates the iframe height, which causes the iframe itself to resize. Finally, we need to apply these styles to get the iframe properly located in the layout of the hosting application after resizing. When we now reload the hosting application, we can see that the frames are properly resizing once the data is loaded in the feature-specific applications. Are you using micro frontends in your projects? What is your approach? Let me know in the comments.